news leader. This is Eye on the Desert from News Channel 3. Welcome to the Valley's premier live arts and entertainment program, Eye on the Desert. I'm your host, Patrick Evans. And if you are ready to cool off and experience some great art, we got something that's going to provide both of those opportunities for you. I got the scoop from an art show that is definitely going to wow you and inspire you. Well, we definitely have the hot times, so it's perfect for the hot times cool art art exhibition that's coming up from the Artist Council. And here to tell us more about that, Ushi Wilson and Paul Messick. Thank you both for being here. Thank You're you. Welcome. Thank you for having us. And we're going to learn more about this piece of art that you brought in in just a moment. First, let's okay. talk about what the Artist Council has been up to. You guys have been busy during this summer. Very, very busy during the summer. We uh, created a volunteers program, which we really desperately needed. We also did tech director here. He installed a lot of new systems. And we booked all of the exhibitions up to June of 2023. Wow. Lots of workshops, like 16, I think, we have already. And other entertainment, like the Desert Baroque, if you remember. And mm -hmm. then, I nearly forgot to tell you, we are opening a store. And we have a test store during the holidays. Fantastic. So yep. people will be able to come in and check that out for great holiday gifts, Christmas That is gifts. correct, yes. Uh, and you have this exhibition coming up. It starts in September. September Hot 14th. Hot Times Cool Art. Yes, very cool art, by the way. September 14th, it goes till October 16th. And uh, it's membership again of 100 pieces, all different mediums. So very exciting, very exciting. And Paul, in addition to being the uh, director of technology at the Artist Council, you also are an artist. And mm -hmm. tell me about this. This is, and I backlit it just a little bit. It's a little hard to see in the studio lights, but this is a really intricate piece uh, of artwork that you put together from layers of glass. Tell me about this. So this is 14 layers of glass. And what I do is I take an image and I divide it into parts and then I paint a different part of the image on each layer. So it has a great amount of depth and dimension. After I paint them, I put them in a kiln, which is like a big oven. I burn the enamel onto each layer. Wow. And then when they're complete, I stack them and I heat them to 1500 degrees surrounded by brick so it doesn't turn into a puddle and it melts <laughs> into one solid piece of glass. I, I, turn this sideways, I'm going to let you do it because I think we can get a shot and show the people the layers. layers. Yeah, there you Look go. Look at this. Yeah. This is really remarkable. 14 different layers. Yes. And then the finished product is, they're not loose inside there. This is all fused together. This is one heavy block of glass. Yes. That is remarkable. When did you start working with glass and, and doing this kind of, this is really intricate work. I, I've been working with glass for almost 20 years, but this particular style I started uh, in 2011, so a little over 10 years ago. Now, is this going to be in the Hot Times Cool Art exhibition? A smaller winter piece okay. will be my yeah. cool art, but wow. it, it will be a similar piece to this. Yes. Well, I just uh, this is a really fantastic piece of art. It's uh, called Winter Air, uh, and you're looking at some of the other pieces that will be uh, shown as well and all members of the Artist Council yes, put this Yes, they together. are. And as you can see, it's from collage to oil, watercolor. Uh, we have sculptures, we have um, mixed media. There's just every, there's a smaller version yeah. of Paul's. You can see that a little better on the image. The uh, Hot Times Cool Art Exhibition runs September 14th through the 16th, Wednesdays through Sundays, 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. It is free. And when will your uh, store open for the holidays? Uh, December 1st, and it runs through December 23rd. And right now it's a test project, like a pop-up store, so we can test the real store coming up. Very exciting. Artistcouncil.com, where you can find out all of the information, find out about the workshops. Thank you both for being here. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you, Patrick. Thank you.